Yeah, her. Can you talk about the emotions of, like, within 10 or 15 seconds, thinking you won the game and then finding out you had Yeah, well, the emotions on the court was high. You know, we felt like we had a great shot. We thought we had enough time, and it was just – it was something that you don't really know until you review, but I felt like emotions there was definitely, we thought we had the game and we just couldn't do nothing about it. So we've got to be positive and move on and work on that for the next game. I don't know of any teams that ever started this season with three straight one-point losses. What was the mood in the locker room and how do you guys uh, keep from feeling sorry for yourselves? Well, with us, uh, it's been tough. Like you said, the three tough losses we took, uh, one thing with us, we keep our heads up and try to be positive. Uh, one thing we talk about in the locker room is how we got to work harder and work on situations like this to in practice to where we don't have to go through this no more. So we just keep fighting and keep giving our effort and everything we do and go 110% harder than we are right now. Percy, you, you mentioned practice. Kenny was just in here and said it hasn't been the best practices recently. What do you think is the cause of having, I guess, subpar practices right now? Uh, well, like you said, I think it's just – Effort is what ultimately is the, the key to our practice. We just got to give effort and everyone has to just buy in. I think that's something we're pretty much we're a new team. So we're all working together to just to build trust and we're just getting better every day. So. Um, you guys, you know, I didn't have a good start uh, shooting tonight. Um, you know, it seemed to get better um, um, uh, coming out of halftime. I'm just wondering um, what was said then and just, you know, any, any sort of a change of plans uh, coming into the second half. But with us at halftime, uh, one thing we had to highlight is how, like you said, we wasn't having the best shooting. Uh, we shot the same amount of shots from the three as we did in the two for field goal percentage. So we kind of just had the conversation on how we got to start the first four minutes off strong and just go at the, go to the rim. With Jalen in foul trouble, you played a lot more, especially in the second half. What what were you trying to give the team offense? Well, well with me, I'm a person who brings a lot of energy, and I try to just – be a defensive stopper or anyone. Like, that's the one thing I take pride in defense. I feel like I can guard anyone one through five. And I just want to be a player where I bring positivity and energy. Um, you know, sorry. Uh, I mean, you just have that moment there, you know, after L hits that shot where you guys are all, you know, you're just, I'm in a crowd at the corner. But then, you know, just to have that taken away from you, uh, just how badly does it make you want to have that feeling and of, you know, getting the win and, you know, having it stick after, like we talked about, these couple of tough uh, one loss. Yeah, uh, but no, that's, win definitely, that's definitely a feeling where it's going to stick with us. And it could be a good thing. It could help us just build on what we felt. You know, we don't want to feel that no more. And I feel like that's going to make us work a lot harder to where we don't got to be in situations like that anymore. So I think that, hey, it's, it's a tough loss, but it's gonna, we're going to learn a lot from it. We, don't, we won't take it as a loss. We'll take it as a lesson. All right. Thanks, sir. Thank you. Love for